Hi and welcome to today's video. Unwanted hair, unwanted body hair, especially the underarms. Today I have a wonderful homemade remedy for you that you can use to get rid of your body hair. Now this is a very quick and a very easy but a very effective remedy. Now once you make this remedy and you use it at least two times per week, you are going to see those hair just you know fall off and before you know it guess what your hair are going to get finer and eventually you're going to notice that your hair is taking forever to grow back or maybe not grow back at all so if you're interested in today's video continue watching our first ingredient is alum and this is alum powder now alum is a chemical compound hydrating salt estrogen salt and alum has been used for centuries to get rid of body hair now alum is also used in pickling and baking it is just an overall ingredient that is both for cooking and also great for removing body hair our next ingredient is gram flour also known as basin and this is actually chickpeas flour and this is great for getting rid of body hair this is also great for oily skin it could help to absorb all the grease on your skin it is actually a wonderful ingredient to incorporate in your beauty routine our next ingredient which is a very popular one is the turmeric and this is turmeric powder and turmeric is great for a lot of things turmeric is one powder that you should always have in your kitchen as it is great for lightening and brightening the skin it is great for removing body hair turmeric is also great for detoxing the body overall turmeric is a must have in your kitchen today we're going to use it to get rid of body hair next ingredient is coconut oil and coconut oil is also great for the skin it's very moisturizing in this recipe i'm using the coconut oil to combine all the ingredients which is going to make it be more effective in getting rid of body hair and our final ingredient is rose water and rose water is great for the skin it is perfect for a toner you can use it on both your face and your body it is also cooling and it also helps to get rid of wrinkles and fine lines on the skin so i'm going to use one tablespoon of gram flour that's one tablespoon of gram flour one teaspoon of alum powder one teaspoon of turmeric powder next i'm going to mix all the dry ingredients together just blend them together make sure it's fully blended especially the alum so you just want to blend this for about 30 seconds just getting it all mixed well now for this mixture the dry ingredient you could mix this like this and you could keep this in your refrigerator in an airtight container for well up to six months when you're ready to use it you could just take it out and add your coconut oil to it and now this is ready and now i'm gonna add my coconut oil so i'm using two tablespoons of coconut oil and now we're gonna mix this together and we're mixing this into a paste up close and this is looking very very good now once this is fully blended you want to make sure to mix well to get rid of all the grains from the alum you want to make sure it is fully mixed out so just mix it for a while at about 30 to 40 seconds just keep mixing or until you feel no grain in the bottom of the container now once this is done we're gonna put this to the side and if you have a double broiler this is where you're gonna reach for your double broiler I'm gonna be using just hot water in this bowl so we're gonna pour our hot water in and next we're gonna take our mixture and we're gonna place it in the hot water and you're gonna just keep stirring it 
So what is gonna happen is that this is gonna get a little thick and this is exactly how you want it to be. So just keep it in there for a couple, a few minutes, probably about two to three minutes. Just keep stirring. Now this is really a wonderful mix. It's a very effective mix and one thing I like about this mixture is that with continuous use of this on your body, you will notice that your hair will take forever to grow back. If you have to, let's say, go on a vacation, start using this about a week or two before and guess what? When you go on your vacation, you will not have to do any form of a shaving because your hair will not grow back this quickly and with continuous use of this, you will eventually notice that your ear has decreased, diminished, or just basically don't grow back at all. All right, so now this is ready and we're gonna remove it. Be careful, it's gonna be very warm and we're gonna set this aside to cool. And once this is cooled, we're gonna use it to remove our body here. Now you, as I said before, you don't want to mix this and put it away in your refrigerator. You want to put the oil to the dry ingredient just before you use it. So make the dry ingredient, store it, and then you just take it out, put your coconut oil in, warm it, and use it immediately. All right, so let's this cool, and then I'm gonna show you how I use it to remove my body here. Now here is our body hair removal treatment and to use this I'm going to demonstrate to you on my hands. Now I would suggest that you wash and cleanse the area before you apply the treatment. If you're using this on your underarms, it would be best for you to exfoliate your underarms first. Therefore, when you apply this, you are applying it to clean skin. The ear follicles are going to be clean and this is going to soften the ear much faster than if you didn't exfoliate or cleanse the skin. So now I'm going to use my hands to demonstrate so I'm just gonna take a little and this is what you need to do you need to take a little of the treatment and you're gonna apply it to wherever you have the body here just apply it all over if you're removing here from your arms like I'm doing here just apply it all over for your underarms you're gonna apply a thick layer to the underarms wherever on your body you're getting rid of unwanted hair. Now you're gonna let it stay there for no less than 10 minutes. If you can go longer, it is even better. If you have coarse hair, you need to wear this at least 30 minutes. However, for very fine hair, 10 minutes is good. Once you get to 10 minutes, your hair is gonna basically just melt. So leave it on, as I said, for at least 10 minutes. For fine hair, for coarse hair, you need to go much longer. Now once the 10 minutes is hot you're gonna use a wash rod or you can just go in the shower and remove it but you can use a cloth and you want to remove it upwards like this just if the hair go down you're gonna move it in the opposite direction now remember this is not shaving this is hair removal so you don't have to follow the downward rule as shaving so just clean the area remove all of the excess and once you're removing this what is gonna happen you're also gonna be removing the hair from your skin now after you remove the treatment on the hair you want to rinse this off with some warm water now once the hair has been removed you want to pat dry do not rub the area just pat dry and you're gonna notice your hair look how clean my hands are next you're gonna reach for your rose water and you're just gonna take a little of the rose water about a one eighth of a teaspoon and you're gonna use it and this time you're gonna do it downwards depending on where you're getting rid of your body here from and you're gonna just use it to massage the area and what the rose water is doing it has been used here as an estrogen and therefore it's gonna protect the skin it's gonna moisturize the skin without any form of a stinging okay now once this is done 
you are good to go. Now you want to use this treatment at least two to three times per week for best result to begin. As soon as you start noticing that the hair is taking longer to grow back, then you keep cutting down, cutting down, and eventually what is going to happen, you probably won't need to shave at all. Now if you have very coarse hair, this is going to take much longer. However, just keep using it, using it, and before you know it, you're on your way to getting rid of your unwanted ear, okay? So there you have it. Thank you all for watching. If you like the video, leave your comment, give it a thumbs up and share the video. And if this was the first time watching, you want to see more of these videos, look below. You're going to see the word subscribe. Just click on it and you will be subscribed. Now don't forget to click the little bell right beside the word subscribe so that each time I upload a video, you will get a notification right away. I also have a show guys and this is Sunday Chit Chat with Chichi Beauty. And this is every Sunday at 4.30 p.m. It's a live interactive show, very interesting. We talk about the topic and we take questions and everyone is able to participate. So join me every Sunday, 4.30 p.m. Eastern Standard Time for Sunday Chit Chat with Chichi Beauty. Thank you all for watching and I'll see you in my next video. Bye-bye.